The animal of the day, March 7th, is the Japanese skeleton shrimp or the binomial name Caprella mutica. Type, skeleton shrimp. Diet class, omnivore. Average lifespan, two to three months. Size, up to two inches or five centimeters in length. Weight, likely a few milligrams. Population status currently the 7th of March 2025, not evaluated. Population estimate, unknown. Native lands, the Sea of Japan and Sea of Okhotsk. Primary habitat, coastal waters along rocky shores, seaweed beds, eelgrass meadows, and man-made structures such as docks, piers, and agriculture equipment. Main predators, gobies, wrasses, juvenile flatfish, crabs, clobsters, nudibranches, starfish, nemertine worms, sea anemones, hydrozoans, and seabirds. Active time, nocturnal. Species age, at most 200 million years old. Notes. The Japanese skeleton shrimp is a species of skeleton shrimp native to shallow, protected bodies of water in the Sea of Japan. In a span of only 40 years, the Japanese skeleton shrimp has become an invasive species having been spread to other parts of the world such as the North Atlantic, North Pacific and off the coasts of New Zealand through multiple accidental introductions from hulls or ballast water of international maritime traffic, aquaculture equipment and shipments of the Pacific oyster. Like all caprolid amphipods, the Japanese skeleton shrimp is characterized by slender bodies and elongated appendages and their skeletal appearance which is what grants them the name skeleton shrimp or ghost shrimp. The Japanese skeleton shrimp also has a distinctive upright feeding posture similar to that of a stick insect or a starved praying mantis. Outside of their native range, the Japanese skeleton shrimp is often exclusively synanthropic, being found in large numbers in and around areas of human activity. The Japanese skeleton shrimp can vary in coloration from translucent pale green, brown, cream, orange, deep red, purple, and even turquoise, depending on the substrate they are found in. The Japanese skeleton shrimp possesses an upper spine along with many other spines. That is particularly known as the poison spine or poison tooth. Although despite its name, it is unclear if the poison spine is actually venomous. Though they are perfectly capable of inflicting potentially lethal injuries on small organisms, but recent studies have associated the spines with pores that lead to possible toxin-producing glands. The dactyli of the Japanese skeleton shrimp are powerful and curve into a scimitar-like shape. The Japanese skeleton shrimp is generally found in temperate and subarctic regions and cannot tolerate water temperatures higher than 82.9 degrees Fahrenheit or 28.3 degrees Celsius and will die within five minutes if exposed to water temperatures of 100 for degrees Fahrenheit or 40 degrees Celsius, and while they can survive in temperatures lower than 28.6 degrees Fahrenheit or minus 1.9 degrees Celsius, they are rendered immobile if not altogether in a state of suspended animation. While the Japanese skeleton shrimp is primarily an omnivorous detritivore, it is a highly adaptive, opportunistic feeder and will go from being a detritivore to being grazers scavengers, filter feeders, and even predators depending on the conditions of their environments. The Japanese skeleton shrimp use their large nathopods to strike and grasp both mobile and sessile prey. The Japanese skeleton shrimp is known to prey on algae both planktonic and macroalgae, dinoflagellates, hydrozoans, bryozoans, diatoms, copepods, brine shrimp, and other amphipods. They have also been known to engage in cannibalistic behaviors on dead and dying individuals of their own species and or genus. Male Japanese skeleton shrimp exhibit aggressive mating behaviors such as aggressively engaging in boxing matches using their large second pair of nathopods in the presence of receptive females, which can often end up lethal. Every day is a new animal, so subscribe for more.